a 1-800-TCM-1002. Hey there, everybody. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. The start of spring is less than a week away, and to me and millions of other Americans, that means one thing. Baseball is right around the corner. Sure, I'll be watching March Madness and the NBA playoffs, but baseball didn't become America's national pastime by accident. It's a complicated, thoughtful game with a proud tradition, which is why I've officially decreed baseball as the official sport of classic movie fans. I have that power. Every year about this time, the powers that be at TCM placate me by pulling out a few baseball classics for me to introduce, one of which we have coming up right now. From 20th Century Fox in 1949, it's a comedy. It happens every spring. Ray Milan stars as a college professor who accidentally invents a liquid that repels wood. And pretty quickly, Milan figures that since baseball bats are made of wood, if he puts his compound on a baseball, a bat couldn't touch it. With the liquid on it, the ball takes a nice little hop over any oncoming bat, and this stuffy professor becomes a very unlikely star pitcher. In the proud tradition of Hollywood baseball movies, Ray Milan looks as though he's never even heard an inning of baseball on the radio. He looks as if he'd be picked last in t-ball. But at least in this comedy, it makes sense because he's not supposed to be much of a ball player. And while it may not be the natural, this film has got a little something that has charmed baseball fans and movie fans for generations. From 1949, also featuring Gene Peters and Paul Douglas, here's It Happens Every Spring. 